Hey everybody, this is Kevin and welcome to a special episode of Let's Play. Um, wait, I'll get the sound a little bit smaller. Ah, much better. Um, today, a very sad day happened. Nintendo announced the death of Satoru Iwata and it hit me pretty hard. So, to honor his death and especially his life as a programmer and producer and CEO of Nintendo, I'm going to play through one of my favorite childhood games, Kirby's Dreamland, which he actually helped. Oh my god! Which he actually helped develop. Uh, I think produce too. So, let's start right away with Green Greens. Yeah, let's go. So, everybody that would likely uh, hear of Kirby would think um, uh, Masahiro Sakurai would be the one only responsible for Kirby, which is true in a sense, but um, Shigeru Miyamoto and Iwata actually helped this game to be produced although they didn't get or didn't want any credit for it I think or maybe they just wanted to show one producer and it's neither one of them so yeah anyway we're here the first mini boss and it's nothing like it's just uh, um, throw the bombs back at him so yeah um, I used to play this game a lot during my childhood. It's it's one of my. It's I know this game in the back of my head, and the sound is weird again. Whatever the fuck. Okay, it's normal again. Um, so yeah, let's. This, this will be a chill, uh, um, a really, really relaxing ride to through this game. I hope you enjoy it. Let's go down trip for memory lane for um Satori Water. Actually I've never um I think he wasn't that much of a public figure until he was promoted to CEO of Nintendo. I think I know him since he announced the Game Boy Advance. But yeah, he's definitely the one of the few people I'm looking up to, especially his programming skills. I don't know if you know one of his skills, uh, about his programming skills, he was a very talented man. I think he's also hailed as one of the best programmers uh, of the world. He, um, oh my god, the sound is just awful. Anyway. He was hailed as one of the uh, best programmers in the world just because of his skills, of his debugging, bug searching skills and also just about of his normal skill as a programmer, I think. Castle <laughs> So what was his feats? He actually was responsible for Earthbound to be programmed. I think he was the main programmer, the main ex executive programmer, I don't know. Um, he might... What I definitely know of is that he was um, responsible for porting the completely undocumented um, battle logic code of of Pokemon Gold and Silver to the Nintendo 64, so Nintendo would be able to just make Pokemon Stadium. So he and he did that in one weekend. And I don't know about you, but uh, battle logic in Pokemon is kind of tricky especially in the first generation and without any documentation yeah this is a really really good feat to put off 
so yeah that's that thanks to him we got Pokemon Stadium so what about that but it doesn't stop here thanks to Iwata we've got uh, Johto and Kanto in Pokemon Gold and Silver the uh, team in development team at Game Freak wasn't still that experienced with programming and stuff and, and, and file size management in the game so what they um, yeah get it so what he did was he compressed the whole game all by itself so it couldn't only fit Jojo but Kanto as well so he just he he reduced the size of the of gold and silver by kind of half yeah that's that's skill that's some skill oh my god whoo that was close so yeah what was what else was the whoops sorry I was just thinking about what to actually do um what else could be said about him he did he did more ah oh, yeah he completely debugged um uh, super smash bros melee so it could be damn it so it could be uh released on time the Masahiro Sakura and his team actually couldn't find all the bugs so Iwata was tasked to look at it and yeah he found all the bugs and did everything in record time so yeah it really shows how amazing this guy is or was yeah Act but I have to admit his business decisions as a CEO were kind of questionable at times he was responsible for the widow, so uh, and this was the most successes, su successful console since I forever. <laughs> um, yeah, but his uh, decisions regarding Wii and stuff, um, yeah, questionable. But he, that doesn't actually matter. He made many people really, really happy. And yeah, stupid cancer. I hate cancer. My father died of it too. And to, and the water stuff actually reminded me of it. And I guess that's why it hits me pretty hard. Yeah. Oh, that nut is is evil. It killed me so many times as a child. Oh, whoa! No, 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 no! Wrong button. <laughs> Oh yeah. During university times, I've actually uh, played this game with Arishishi. We speedrun this during um, during <laughs> during a reading, during a lecture, and yeah. Oh, glad we didn't get in trouble for it, but it was fun. I don't know what the winner got, but yeah. Maybe she knows. Ariel, you're allowed to comment here now. <laughs> so... Whoa! Little trivia of this... Um, of this level. This is actually my favorite level in the entire game. Um, many people have problems with the boss here in this stage, but... I mean, not so much. I don't know what people think of it, but oh, and this is this, this is kind of mind blowing, I guess. Um, you your hot chili power up ends when you get into water. I f I always thought this was pretty cool. Yeah. So up to the whale. It's boss time. Rez was such a reward known for. Um, he cut his he cut his salary in half when Nintendo had rough times, so nobody would have been laid off. So yeah, 
he that's just he was a great CEO. See, no problem. And now for my most hated stage ever, bubbly clouds, I hate it. Probably die here. So we'll see. <laughs> um Yeah, Ivada, you will dearly be missed. Seriously, I've always looked up to you. He was one of the reasons I want to go into game design. Or rather just be a programmer, just because I don't know. He is a great guy. He was, yeah, he was a great guy. I'm, I'm repeating myself, but uh, I really don't know what to say. It's like I said, it's hitting me pretty hard because it's kind of personal, or oh, where the memories are personal. So yeah. Yeah, it's it's. I was at a loss of words right now. Nah, I won't start crying here. I hope. I hope I won't start crying. Oh my god. <laughs> nah. I didn't really cry about his death. It's not heartless. I just don't cry that often anymore. Just because of the yeah, arm, death of my father. Yeah, I'm getting really personal here, but my god. It's not that bad. Yeah, I, I, I got tearful, I, had to, I have to admit. But like I said, I'm not really crying. It's just, yeah, it's life. We have to deal with it. Now, oh my god, sorry, I didn't talk here. I uh, just I have to concentrate on this boss and then the cloud boss. I hate them with a passion. <laughs> so. I hope you like this this little try weird um, episode. I hope Ewater sees it. I mean, he has all the time in the world now just to see it and kind of like see everything and learn every language so he can um, understand everything and stuff. Yeah. Go, 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 go. This is... These holes are really mean here. Alright. Let's go into the special one. Yay! Oh. I remember there were some spikes. One up. Whew. Or not. I guess it was a DDD level. Anyway, welcome to Gordo. What's Gordo his name? I don't know. I hate this boss. It's This thing is so random. Got a good RNG here. A really good one. Alright, um, so Satori, well, I think he had program Kirby's Return to Dreamland, but I've never played it. I might play it in the future. 
Oh, I just not have to also say uh, I'm sorry for not uploading the last time, but I really was kind of busy. Not, I was busy, but yeah. I'm sorry. I f I hope I I rectify in the future. So yeah. But this is an episode for Iwata and it shall stay on Iwata topic. So what's next? Nintendo ha has to appoint a new CEO and I don't know if Iwata has made preparations for any um, successor yet. I think I think he might have just because of uh, he might knew that it was almost time for him I mean you you might uh, you might you might hey okay right now all the buttons were kind of the same here okay um but I don't I really don't know if he if he accounted for it might have well if not I think his his successor will be like he will be um, Shigeru Miyamoto or even though I don't want it to be Shigeru he ha he should stay to make games and he wouldn't have really time for it in um, when he gets appointed as CEO so Hmm, it's a really hard decision here. It might be someone we don't know yet. So, yeah, I hope he presents, he or she rather represents himself or herself in Nintendo Direct and I really hope it's, it will be still as fun and entertaining as the other uh, Nintendo Directs. We'll, it will definitely miss something and it will become sad for a while but Nintendo will keep forward and it won't stay that way forever <laughs> I'm sorry I'm, I'm really talking monotone <laughs> I think I'm always uh, um, apologizing for something in my let's plays, be it my bad acting, my bad voice acting, my bad English or something, but I'm 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 sorry. <laughs> wow. He's giving really good RNG now. Wow. Nice. Anyway, um, he did more programming feats. That much I know. He was. Wait, I. I know that he was hailed as one of the most um, one of the most valued programmers in at Nintendo, and with with programmers and teams that like Masahiro Sakura and stuff, it was just um, oops. I wanted to go down there. <laughs> anyway, um, Masami Sakura and his team are one of the best programmers out there. They managed to uh, make uh, Smash Brothers 4 on 3DS and it runs at 60 frames per second. So, <laughs> yeah, that's beat. Oh, by the way, we are almost at the end here. Only that boss? Oh, 
Alright, it's time for King DDD. In the final stages of this boss. Um Ah damn it. Ah, Iwata, you're a great man. <laughs> I can't stress that one <laughs> enough. But really, thank you. Now, time to murder DDD. No, not DDD. DDD is a really likable character, actually. Especially in the newer games. Ah. Oh my god. Should stay that close to him. Ah. God damn it. Alright, what happens now? Phew, that was close. Uh oh. No, uh -oh. no, 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 no. Okay. He got me, <laughs> and also on the on his last slide. Ah, <sighs> God. Let's continue with this. Oh my God! Now he's got really bad RNG. Or not? I don't know. Uh uh, okay, it's not that bad. Oh, it's definitely not bad. Oh, okay. Worth it. The sound is really annoying. Not the, not the actual music, but my... the emulator is, is kind of fucked. No! Okay. And one more. Goodbye, DDD. Bam. Boom! Oh, that's not the location I kicked him out of. Anyway. Let's go! Oh, I think I thought it was the victory fanfare now. <coughs> Yay! Fruits! Food! The credits! Director Chief Designer Masahiro Sakurai Chief Programmer Kyohai Miyabi Sa Programmer Sunday Ray Mami Prego Tetsuya Notoya, okay. I'm wondering who will the producer be? I want to know. <laughs> I know it's not um, Iwata. He wasn't credited in this game, so... But he was Makoto Kanai, I see. And so many players. <laughs> Aww. Yeah. Okay. So I guess everybody... This is it. Thank you for playing. Thank you Iwata for playing the game of life and making so many people happy. This episode was just for you. And I hope you'll have a great afterlife. And everyone watching, thank you for watching and goodbye.